All right, hey everybody, welcome back. Joining us now is Stephanie Brazil, editor and co-owner of 501 Life Magazine. It is always good when you join us in the studio. She is one of the nicest, sweetest person to ever come on. <laughs> Truly, I mean that. And she has an incredible magazine. The picture here behind us is the cover. And you were just saying, it really doesn't even do that full image justice. It truly doesn't. This is one of our many collections featured in the July issue, and it's vintage Airstream trailers. So you have to check the story out in the magazine. And also, you can go to our website and see even more pictures. And the whole thing is about different things that people People are collecting in and around Arkansas. How did he get involved? What did you say? Vintage trailers collecting those? Vintage Airstream trailers. So of course we're looking for unique items in central Arkansas that people collect and when we came across this idea we really wanted to go with it. We know a lot of Arkansans love to camp so we felt like a lot of our readers would be interested. Yeah this is what what do you call it glamping when it's like over the top incredible trailer but one of the things that stuck out in this magazine that people are collecting is meteors Yes. Meteorites and Meteorites. people can go see them? Yes. Um, Robert Woolard is a pharmacist in central Arkansas and he's collected more than 2,000 meteorites over 30 years. So he has donated a lot of those to University of Little Rock, University of Arkansas at Little Rock, yes. where you can go and see that collection. He has a lot at his home too. And they range from smaller than a marble to 125 pounds. And one thing that's special about Robert, uh, he's found these in five states and four foreign countries. But he said that when Neil Armstrong stepped onto the moon that was paid for with taxpayer dollar, dollars so they didn't get any souvenirs so he found a lunar meteorite had it sliced sent a piece to Neil Armstrong doing the people's work and people can <laughs> check that out at UALR too yes that's awesome talk about some of the other issues I know um Miss Ebony Mitchell, Miss Arkansas, the newly crowned, she's been on the show. Yes. She's featured in this magazine as well. Yeah, we really appreciate that she's trying to reach out to elementary age kids and teach them to be responsible online. She calls that a responsible digital you, and she's been doing this for some time with the Attorney General's office and also the Arkansas Department of Education. So, you know, this matters to parents. This matters to grandparents. And she said she cares about it because she really messed up 10 years ago when she started getting online, giving her her name, address, things a lot of kids do. So she's trying to educate kids throughout Arkansas, mailing out materials throughout Arkansas and doing presentations. Yeah, she's so open and honest about her own journey and she speaks a lot about it here in this issue. You are also highlighting another teen. Who is that? Yes, Ann Gal. She's our youth of the month and Ann has been taking piano since she was five. It, this is her third year to be the drum major at um, Little Rock Central High School. So she's very talented, but during the pandemic, she realized she really missed performing for live audiences. So she has gotten together 75 other teen performers and they go to senior living centers and do concerts. They've done 45 since March. And Ann just says, you know, it feels so nice to perform for them. They're very appreciative and that feeds our desire to become better musicians. I love it. It sounds like a great issue and I was just telling her earlier, I usually don't like magazines because most of them are filled with ads. There is so much substance in this and so much Thank that you. highlights the great in Arkansas. Go check this out and they're at grocery stores all across and Central Arkansas. And restaurants, bookstores, we're at 700 locations in 11 counties. So if you can't find us out there because all of them are picked up, check us out online at 501lifemag.com. I promise it is worth your time. Thanks for being here. We will see Thank you, you next Hunter. month Thank and we will see you right after the break.